Hello. Good evening. Hi. Good evening. Good evening, Hi. Stephanie and Norma Leticia. How are you doing today? Good. Oh. And you? I'm very good. Thank you so much for asking. How was your day? Cansado. Enferma. <laughs> Oh, I'm really sorry. Mm -hmm. I hope you get um get over it soon. You get over it. Se recupere, okay? Mm -hmm. And how was your day? Busy? Working? Sorry. Okay, we're going to wait for another two minutes to start the class, okay? Okay, let me let me share my screen. Hello, Moises Giovanni. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you today? I'm tired. <laughs> I know. The battery is 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 low. We are we have just twenty five percent at this time, <laughs> <laughs> but. Just one hour, okay? And then you're going to go to sleep. Good evening, Kevin Giovanni. Good evening. How are you doing today? How are you today, Kevin? That's uh, okay. Nice. Uh, nice, my day is nice. That's good, okay. <clears throat> okay, let me share my screen. Is there? Okay. Can you see my screen now? Yes? Yes. 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 Okay. Good. Oh. <clears throat> Good evening, Carla Roselia, Stephanie, Carolina, Norma Leticia, Moises Giovanni, and Kevin Giovanni, okay? Hey. So, today is um, Tuesday, no November the 29th, 2022. So the agenda for today. So we're going to study the weather seasons and the possessive pronouns, okay? We're going to review the possessive adjectives and the possessive pronouns. They are similar, but they are different, okay? Um, we have a conversation and then we are going to practice, okay? Good. The main objectives for this lesson at the end of this class, you will be able to use poss possessive in order to describe belongings of scenes, okay? 
Also, you will be able to, to become familiar with the weather season. Van a aprender vocabulario acerca de las estaciones del año y cómo describir objetos que les pertenecen a ustedes o a otras personas. Ok? Very good. So, to start the class, I have a review about vocabulary that we studied yesterday. Ok? I want that... Um, you remember this cloth vocabulary that we reviewed yesterday. Okay. En el orden que los tengo, voy a ir llamando sus nombres. Ustedes me dicen one number that you can see in my screen. And then when I click on it, van a ver una prenda de vestir y me dicen que es. Okay. It is a review. Okay. Stephanie Carolina, give me one number. Number seven. Okay. What do you remember? Um, someone that can help her. ¿Quién le puede ayudar? Hat. Okay. Hat. Cuando es, es una, es una, sorry. What's there? Ok, es una gorra, right? Entonces sería cap. C-A-P, ok? Cap. Cap. Mm -hmm. Ok, good. Alison, give me a number. Um, number three. Number three. Okay. What do you remember? Es, uh, es un suéter. Sí, vale. Yes, it is. Es un um, es. No sé si es suéter. 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 Mhm. Gris a suéter. Okay, good. Okay. <clears throat> Anna Ruth, good evening. Number one. Number one. Anna Chunka. Mm -hmm. How do you say that name in English? You can say you can say that is a jacket <clears throat> or that is a waterproof sweater because con esta se puede mojar y no le y no le filtra, right? It is a waterproof jacket. Jacket. Sweater. Yes, a jacket. Okay, good. Uh Kevin Giovanni. Um, number nine. Number nine. This is an umbrella. It is an umbrella. Yes, that is an umbrella. Okay, very good. Um, <clears throat> Moises Giovanni. Mm, 11. Mm, but. Yes, but. Very good. It is. Those are books. Okay, good. Um, <clears throat> Stephanie Carolina? Um, Give me a number. Number two. Number two. What is that? T-shirt. Yes, it is. It is T-shirt. It is a T-shirt. Okay. Good. Okay, volunteers, write your, your hand if you want to participate. Levanta su manita. Okay, Norma Leticia, give me a number. 
Number five. Number five. Ah. It is hat. Hat, yes. H A T, right? Hat. Okay, very good. Uh, Carla Roselia. Number eight. Ah. This one. It is a short. Okay. Short. Very good. That is a short. Okay. Um, Stephanie Lisette. Number six. <laughs> Mm -hmm. What do you remember? What is that? Is a scarf. A scarf. Okay, it is a scarf. Okay, good. Um, who else? Quem mais quer participar? Okay, Crisia. <laughs> Buenas noches, mil. Uh, number good 12. Good evening, Crisia. Hi, good evening. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Uh, sandalias, uh, sandals, algo así se dice. Yes, these are sandals. Okay. Sandals. <clears throat> okay, good. Thank you. Good. Someone else? Are you must? Who wants to participate? Okay, let me call someone. Um, <clears throat> Jennifer Tatiana, give me a number. Jennifer? Good evening, four. Good evening, number four. Ah. Mm -hmm. What do you remember? The rain. 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 Rain cut. Okay. This is a rain cut. Okay. And Anna Ruth. The last one. Number 10, Anna Ruth. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Pants. 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 Okay. What is the other name that we learned yesterday? Mm. Do you remember? Mm. <clears throat> who, no. who remember the other name that we in that we learned that is similar with pants? Trousers. Trouser. Yes. Trousers. Trouser. Okay. Good. Very good. Good review. It was good. Okay. Today we're going to we're going to study um the possessive adjectives and pronouns, okay? Mm -hmm. Look at the difference. Look at the difference. We have adjectives and we have pronouns. Okay. Mm -hmm. Look at the difference in the sentences. Y me van a decir cuál diferencia le encuentran. Okay. These are his socks. Okay. His. Look at this. Is here. Between the verb and the, and the name, okay? Está entre el nombre, entre el verbo y el nombre. Okay, now look at the other sentences. Miren la otra oración. These socks are hers. Okay. ¿Quién me puede decir la diferencia? Eh, el, el, el objeto. Es, va una va al, al final y el otro va al principio que aquí serían calcetines creo que son sacos no yes 
Pero ese es el noun. Ese eh, es, pronombre, es el complemento de la, de, de la oración, ¿ok? Entonces, okay. <coughs> the possessive adjectives va between, ¿ok? Van en medio de la oración. Pero mm -hmm. los pronouns van al final. Si ven acá, hers va al final, ¿ok? Entonces, si dice my, está diciendo que es mío, right? My car. <clears throat> that is my car. Ese es mi carro. Pero si digo that car is mine, ese carro es mío, my va a ir al final, ¿ok? ¿Qué es esto? Esta significa lo mismo, pero depende dónde lo, cómo lo uso, así voy a diferenciar si uso un, un adjective o uso un pronoun. pronoun. Ok. Good. Ese es un buen ejemplo, lo que les decía. That is my car. Estoy usando my antes del nombre. My car. Voy a usar este primero. Pero si digo, ese carro, that car is... My. Cambio la oración. Utilizo el pronoun at the end of the sentence. Y estoy diciendo lo mismo. Significa lo mismo. Right? It's another way to say uh, one sentence. Ok. La diferencia es que le agregamos una S. Your. Yours. His. His. Este es el único que va igual, ¿ok? Que no cambia. Her, hers. Our, ours. Their, theirs. ¿Ok? Le agregamos una S cuando es. Pronoun. ¿Ok? <clears throat> uh, Tenemos ejemplos también con apóstrofes. Cuando el apóstrofe significa que a, a algo le pertenece a alguien, es la forma de escribir una forma más, una forma corta, ¿ok? Por ejemplo, that blouse, ¿ok? Que es la blusa de de Pat, Pat blouse, Julie, Julie's jeans. La, solo le agregamos la s. Al, al, al nombre, le ponemos el apóstrofe y escribimos el nombre del objeto que pertenece a esa persona, ¿ok? Red T-shirt, ¿ok? Preguntas, whose blouse is this? Me estoy preguntando de quién es esa blusa, ¿ok? Who, whose blouse is this? It is Pat's. ¿Ok? No uh -huh. necesito mencionar una no necesito mencionar el nombre de la blusa porque ya el, en la pregunta ya, ya está, ¿ok? Solo es de Patty. It is Pat. Whose jeans are these? They are Julie's. ¿Ok? Con, solo con el apoyo. Con el apóstrofe ya estamos eh, refiriéndonos a que son de Julie. Do you have questions about this grammar explanation? ¿Tienen preguntas de esta gramática? <laughs> Feel free to ask. Siéntanse libres de, de preguntar, ¿ok? Porque es cuando podemos aclarar. Cristian, ¿preguntas? Estoy eh, entendiendo. Eh, no, eh, de repasar. Eso es todo. Eh, volverlo a estudiar. Eh, yo solo tengo lo de eh, Iris Pat, eh, de la blusa, y jeans, como es en plural, por eso usamos el are this. ¿O por qué lo usamos el are? En... Porque es en plural. Whose Ajá, jeans are these? Uh -huh, porque es en plural. O sea, como les decía, las, 
con las tijeras, scissors, como son dos, o sea, es una, pero uh -huh. va este, en dos partes. Igual uh -huh. que los jeans, eh, se, se identifican como plural. Ok. Aunque estamos hablando de uno. Ok. Um, ¿Preguntas? Norma, Moisés, Kevin. ¿No? ¿Es it clear? No, no dice la verdad, solamente de repasar. Lo que pasa es que pues, a veces uno no tiene tiempo así como para, wow, wow, lo voy a repasar cinco veces. Yes, that is true. Miss, eh, y donde dijo, there, uh, there is my car y that car is mine, el there y el that es por qué. Oh, hagamos, escribamos la oración. Hmm. That sí es, es, es um, como eso. O pueden decir this también, es válido. This is my, my car. Esa sería la primera oración, ¿ok? This is my car. Ahora lo hacemos de la otra forma usando el pronoun y, le, y decimos this car is my. Utilizamos el pronoun, this one. Okay. En la primera utilizamos el adjective. Ok. This is okay. my car. Ajá. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. O sea que nosotros podemos usar this is my car y this car is mine. Yes. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. Ok. La diferencia es, el, es el, eh, el orden del nombre. Cuando utiliza el adjetivo, el nombre va al final. Cuando utiliza el primero, este, my. This is my car. El nombre va al final, que es el car. Pero si utiliza el pronoun, el nombre va a ir en medio. This car is mine. Uh -huh. Y el pronoun va a ir al final. Okay. That is the difference. We're going to the uh, ex examples here. Vamos a hacer unos ejemplos. Um, Ok. Es una conversación. This is a conversation that we're going to complete. Uh -huh. This is a, the first question. Is this Jennifer hat? No, it is not hers. Si se fijan, aquí está uh -huh. el possessive. Possessive. Ella. Yes. Ese sería el possessive um, for now. Que lo voy a poner de otro color. Pronouns, ajá. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Iría al, ir al final de la respuesta. Aquí está un punto. Ok. No. It is not hers. No, no es de ella. It is mine. Mine. My. Uh -huh. Sería este. Sería my porque está usando el hers. Porque está usando pronombre. Y sería my porque eh, eh, va al final de la oración. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. yes. si, si, si cambiara y, di, y dijera... It is my car. Si estoy di diciendo que es, es eh, car, al final, ¿cuál iría entonces? El otro, ¿verdad? Iría este. Si dijera, it is my car, iría este. Pero como no estoy mencionando ya el carro, porque se entiende. Perdón, eh, en este caso estamos hablando de, de la gorra. De la gorra. Eh, 
se entiende que está hablando de la gorra. Entonces, por eso dice, it is mine, ¿ok? Ok. <clears throat> ok, number two. Are these you? yours, yours. yours or yours gloves? Your. Yours gloves. Yours. Sin la S. Sería el your. possessive adjective. Porque al final estoy diciendo el nombre de el objeto, que sería guantes, gloves. ¿Ok? Sería este el correcto. Answer. No, they are not. Aquí sería my or, ok, my with M-Y or mine with m I N E. My. Por aquí tengo los. My. Aquí tengo otra vez los los el nombre. Y al final, entonces debe ser my. Okay. My. 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 Yes. My. My. Porque estoy mencionando otra vez el nombre, ¿ok? No, they are not my gloves. Ok, let's ask Sally. Maybe their hair or hers? Hair. 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 Okay. Maybe theirs, her gloves. Maybe son de ellas, tal vez son de ella. Okay. <clears throat> Whose or, or yours? Whose. Whose. Okay. Whose? Oh, are these? Okay, are these? ¿De quién son? Are the Julie's and Pat? Okay, are the Julie's and Pat? Es, son dos preguntas ahí. Y dice, no, they are not yeah. there or theirs. There. 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 Yeah. They are t-shirts. But these socks are there yeah. or theirs? Theirs. There. Ok. Theirs. Porque aquí ya llegamos al final de la oración. Hay un punto. Right? Ok. And these chores are yeah. your or yours? Yours. Yours. Ok. Yours. Ok. Good. Number... Okay, the other conversation. Hey, these are not our or our clothes. Our. 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 Okay. You are right. Uh -huh. our, our or our. 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 Without the letter S. Our. Are over there. Estamos hablando de la misma clothes, de la misma ropa, right? Okay, good. Ahora sí me entienden eh, un poco más la diferencia? How to use them? Yes? Okay, good. Uh, now we're going to practice the pronunciation. Okay? Who wants to participate? <clears throat> Let me see. Sorry. Uh, okay, Brenda Isela and Stephanie. Okay, Brenda, you're going to be letter A and Stephanie, letter B. <laughs> Okay, teacher. Is this Jennifer's hat? Hat? No. No. It's not hers. Is it mine? It's Are this not. your it's glove? Mine. Are this your glove? No, they are not. No, they are not mine gloves. Let, let's as Sally. Maybe they're 
They are gloves. Whose t-shirts are these? Are they Julie's and Pat's? No, they are not their t-shirts. But these socks are theirs and these shorts are yours? Hey, these are not our club. You're right or you're right or are are over there. Okay. <clears throat> good. Very good. Gloves. Okay. Gloves. Gloves. Okay. Thank you. Someone else? Alguien más who wants to participate? Okay, Kevin and Chrysia, go ahead. Siempre me toca con Kevin. Un <laughs> gusto. <laughs> Igualmente. <laughs> uh, Kevin is A in, in, in Miller B. Okay. 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 It is Jennifer's hat. No, it is not. It is not hers. It is mine. Are these your gloves? No, they are not. My no, they are not my gloves. Let's ask Sally. Maybe they're her gloves. Whose t-shirt are these? Are they Julie's and Pat's? No, they are not there. T no, they no, they are not their t-shirt. But these okay. socks uh, are theirs and this short and yours. Hey, these are not our clothes. You're right. Or, or are over there. Okay, very good. Gloves. Repeat that. <clears throat> Gloves. 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 Okay, because that is plural, okay? And also, repeat this. Close. 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 It, it, it sounds like a letter Z at the end. Closed. Closed. Close. Close. Okay, good. <clears throat> okay, Carla Roselia, do you want to participate? Yes? Okay, someone else who wants yes. to who wants to complete the conversation with Carla? Volunteers? Mm, give me a okay, Norma Leticia, go ahead. Okay. Permítame. Is, is this Jennifer's hat? No, it is not. Her. Her, it is my. Are these your gloves? No, they, no, they are no my gloves, legs. I'm sorry. Whose who's, who's t-shirts are these? Are, are they Julie's and Pat's? No, they, they're no hair t-shirt, but this sock. Socks are there and these shirts are yours. 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 Hey, these are not our clothes. You're right. Ours are over, over there. Okay. 
Okay, thank you. Uh, try to repeat, okay? When you have time, if you think, if you piensan que, que se les hace un poquito difícil la pronunciación de algunas palabras, utilicen un, un diccionario online que tiene eh, pronunciación. And try to repeat, repeat, repeat the pronunciation. Uh, para que así se les quede, ok? Good. Um, thank you. Thank you. Ok, very good. So, there is no questions how to use adjectives, possessive adjectives and possessive pronouns. No dudas? No. Good. Okay, now we're going to to speak about uh, weather and seasons, okay? What are the seasons in El Salvador? Do you know? ¿Cuáles son las estaciones que tenemos aquí en El Salvador? Summer. Summer? Winter. Uh, winter. winter. Okay. Um, maybe, um, windy. Uh-huh. Podría ser otra, other season when it's windy. Uh, cold, maybe in some places. Tal vez en algunos lugares, pero no en todo el país. Mm -hmm. That is cold. Um, warm. Okay. And what is your favorite season? Winter or when is sunny? Sunny. Sunny. Okay. Okay. Who likes winter? Can I gusta when it's raining? El que puede estar en la casa tomando café. <laughs> ok. Bueno. So, <clears throat> it is a spring in, in Brazil. It is warm. And it is very sunny. Ok. It is summer in Korea. Ok. It is it, it is raining, it is hot and humid. It is, it is cool, it is cold. Cool. Cold. It is cloudy and windy. Mm. Okay. I know this. And windy, do you know what is windy? No? Cuando hace? Viento. Viento, yes. It is winter in, in Russia. It is snowing. It is very cold. Okay. Um, do you have questions about the vocabulary that we have here? Tiene preguntas del vocabulario? Solo sobre otoño, eh, yo he escuchado autumn, no sé si. Yes. Es también correcto, se puede usar. Yes, it is, um, you said otoño, right? Yes. Yes, or you can say uh, fall. 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 Another question? I'm going to give you more vocabulary related to uh, the weather and seasons, okay? Uh, let me 
send you a video in order you can listen to the pronunciation of the different um, seasons that we have. Let me send it here. Home is hot. Okay, is there? <clears throat> Let me send it to the to the WhatsApp group. Just a moment. Okay, <clears throat> let me write it. Let me look it, look for it in my cell phone. Okay, it's there. You have three minutes. Okay, <clears throat> done. <clears throat> Very good. <clears throat> autumn. Yes, this is the other way to say otoño. Autumn. Autumn, okay. Um, autumn. That is a way that you're spelling. Or you can say fall. F. A L L. Lo que me preguntaba. Eh... Who asked me that? ¿Quién me preguntó? Me. Yes. Yes. Good. That is the other way to 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 spell it so to say that that season. Okay. Good. Um. Do you have new vocabulary here? It's cloudy, cloudy, okay, it's cloudy. It is raining, it's raining, okay? It's snowy or it's snowing. It's another, um, you can say it's, it's snowy or it's snowing, 
okay? It is windy, it is stormy, stormy. Cuando está bien lluvioso. Uh, it is hailing. Hailing. Cuando hay, cuando, cuando hay granizos. <clears throat> it is hot. It is cold or it is chilly. It mm -hmm. is dry. Cuando tenemos una estación super seca. It is dry. Okay. It is clear. Cuando todo está bien claro. It is humid. Mm -hmm. It is sunny. Or it is foggy. Nublado. Okay. Do you have questions? Tienen preguntas? No. Okay. And what is your favorite weather? Prisia, what is your favorite weather? It's sunny. It's or sunny. clear. Or clear. Okay. Uh, Stephanie Lisette, what is your favorite weather? Windy. When it's windy? Uh, favorite. Windy or uh, clear. Or clear. Okay. Good. Kevin Giovanni, what is your favorite weather? The weather is calm, calm and sunny. And sunny. Okay, good. Okay, very good. So now we have a conversation about the the seasons or the weather. Let me. Snowing. <clears throat> okay, it is very cold. Oh no, what is the matter? It is snowing and it is very cold. Are you wearing your gloves? No, they are at home. Well, you are wearing your coat. But my coat isn't warm. And I am not wearing boots. Okay, let's take a taxi. Porque no aguantar, sense, Yuli. Okay, very good. Do you have vocabulary, new vocabulary in this conversation? Tienen nuevo vocabulario? Did you mm -hmm. find? No? No, right. Mo mother, mother? ¿Cómo se dice? Mother. Mother. Oh, what is the mother? Uh, mother, I have a doubt. What is the mother? It, it is similar with problem. Okay, similar. What is what is the problem? ¿Cómo se pronuncia, Miss? Mother. Matter. 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 What is the matter? Matter. What is the wedding? Matter. Yes. Matter. Okay. Wedding. Wedding, Miss. Wedding. Wedding. What is the meaning? Yes. Wearing your gloves. When you are wearing, wearing what are you wearing now? A, yes, a, a black sweater, right? So what are you wearing? Stephanie Lisette? ¿Qué está usando ahorita usted? I... <clears throat> ah, wearing, yeah, yeah. I wearing a uh, no, blouse, black and white, black, black, black and, and, white. Um, and white blouse, my coat, and um, what shirt. Okay, good. Okay. Who wants to read the conversation? I need two volunteers. To practice, to the practice pronunciation. Me, teacher. Raise your hand. Okay, Kevin and Brenda Isela. Go ahead. 
Kevin is Pat and Brenda is Julie. Okay. Oh no. What's the matter? It is snowing and it is very cold. Are you wearing your glove? No, they are at home. Well, you're wearing your coat. But me, but my coat is warm, and I am not wearing boots. Okay, let's stay a taxi. Thanks, Julie. Okay. Good. Warm. Okay. Warm. Warm. Snowing. Matter. Gloves. Cut. Boots. Okay. Good. Someone else? Alguien más? Who wants to participate? <clears throat> okay, let me let me select, let me pick pick someone. Okay. Um Natalie Abigail and Anna Ruth. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Diga. Anna Ruth. Sí. Okay, you will be Pat and Natalie. Julie. Oh, no. um, what what the matter? It's running in is very cool. Are you wearing your gloves? No they rig home. Well well you're wearing your coat. Back my cocks in the war in I am not query book. Okay, query book. Okay, let's take a taxi. Thank you, Julie. Okay, thank you, both of you. Okay. Oh no, oh no, it's como despla como oh no, como la regué, right? What is the matter? It's a question, right? What is the matter? It is snowing yeah. and it is very cold. Are you wearing your gloves? No, they are at home. Well, you are wearing your coat. But my coat isn't warm and I'm not wearing boots. Okay, let's take a taxi. Thank you. Julie. Okay. Try to um repeat, okay, the pronunciation of the most difficult words for you. Si la palabra es difícil, si usted siente que es difícil to pronounce, uh try to repeat, okay? Repeat and repeat. Uh le voy a enviar otra vez el link del diccionario que yo uso para para que puedan chequear la pronunciación. Ahí la, 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 el significado les sale en inglés porque es un diccionario inglés-inglés, pero les sirve para la pronunciación. ¿Ok? Good. ¿Someone else who wants to participate? ¿Alguien más que quiere participar? Let me see. Ok, Stephanie Lisset. And Carla Roselia, go ahead. Oh no. What is the matter? It's snowing and it's very cold. Are you wearing your gloves? No, they, they are at home. Well, you're wearing your coat? But my coat isn't warm and I'm not wearing boots. Okay, let's say a taxi. 
Thanks, Judy. Okay, good. Very good. That is for you just to <clears throat> practice, okay? Now, um, try to include what you have learned today, what we have learned today, whether in seasons, whether uh, also possessive adjectives and pronouns, okay? And uh, write um, three sentences. Escriban tres oraciones in your notebook, and then I will ask you. Using the vocabulary that you have learned today, and uh, or positive adjectives. Por ejemplo, la oración que les daba de ejemplo, okay? Uh, this is my car. That uh, this car is mine. That is an example uh, about the weather. One sentence is using the weather or seasons. ¿Qué pueden hacer? It is windy today. Or you can say the name of, of a place. Uh, in Chalatenango is very cold. Un lugar que ustedes conozcan. Y díganme uh the weather in that place okay try to write three sentences please tres oraciones Let me know when you are ready. Cuando estén listos, let me know. Are you ready, Kevin? Kevin? Uh, no. No yet. Eh, todavía me falta. Todavía me falta. Okay. <clears throat>
Ready? Listos. Yes, Miss. Okay, good. Tricia, tell me your sentence. It's very hot in Sonsonate. Okay. It's very cold in the USA. Okay, good. Yeah. The white computer is mine. The white computer is mine. It's okay. mine. It, that's my white, no, it, that's my white computer. Very good. Okay, uh -huh. excellent. Okay, Carla Roselia? I live in Huayua City and the weather it was cold today. Okay. And and I I can say um she is my daughter. Yes. And she's my daughter and my daughter is her. My daughter is her. Uh, ¿Qué quiere decir usted? Tradúzcamelo en español. Um, for example, in she she is my daughter. Mm -hmm. And I can, um, for example, uh, ella, ella es mi hija. Oh, she and is my daughter. daughter. Okay. Mi hija es ella. Oh, my daughter is, is, is her. Is her. Pero en uh -huh. ese caso no utilizaría el possessive uh, pronoun, solo, um, Está refiriéndose a ella. Oh, yeah. oh, I understand. Okay. Okay. Eh, dice usted, she is my daughter. Es mi hija, right? My daughter is? She. Is. Is she? Is she. No, is her. Pero en ese caso está refiriéndose, ella es mi hija. O sea, it is the same. It is the same. Um, my daughter, she is my daughter. My daughter is? Is her. Is her. It's the same. Pero no iría con, con, la, con, con el possessive. Ok. Solo se refiere a ella, se está refiriendo a ella. Lo utilizaría siempre como, 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 ref, como ella, para referirse a ella, pero sin la S. Sería solo Her. para referencia de ella. Ajá. Ok. 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 Good. Kevin? Yes. Uh... The weather in Apaneca is cool. It is hot in my house. It is okay. night is calm. Uh, repítame la última. It is night is calm. This night is calm. This, uh, okay. Okay. This. Esta noche está, is calm. That is the weather. Okay. Okay. Very good. Good. Thank you so much. Los demás, mañana se lo, les voy a preguntar al inicio de la clase. Así que terminen las oraciones. And tomorrow we are going to continue. Okay. Okay, miss. Okay. Do you have questions? ¿Tienen preguntas? No, mm -hmm. not yet. Okay. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Okay. Good night, Miss. Good night. Good Take night. Care. Good night. Good night. Okay, bye. Bye.